One of Meghan Markle's last roles was actually in a Hallmark movie. Which flick was it and what was her other Hallmark film? Keep watching to find out. Before marrying Prince Harry, becoming the Duchess of Sussex, and welcoming two children into the world, Meghan Markle lit up the small screen, acting in numerous television shows and commercials. Although this is pretty much common knowledge to anybody who's familiar with her past, fewer people are aware of the fact that she also starred in two Hallmark movies. While the actor is likely best remembered for her turn as Rachel Zane on Suits, Markle's two Hallmark movies are just as heartwarming — and as cheesy as you might expect. As it turns out, Hallmark itself was a great fit for an actor who apparently has an affinity for the network's feel-good flicks. In an interview promoting the Hallmark movie Dater's Handbook, Markle praised the network for providing light and easy entertainment that can make everybody feel good. She added, "...it's just really heartwarming and affirming and validating, and I think, especially in this day and age, it's so nice for families to be able to all watch programming together." Perhaps Markle summed it up best when she said, keeps it really light and easy and makes everybody feel good. At the end of a long day, that's what I want to watch." Dater's Handbook wasn't the first Hallmark movie Markle had starred in, however. In the 2014 movie When Sparks Fly, the future royal plays Amy Peterson, a journalist who returns to her small town to cover a Fourth of July celebration. During her visit, Amy is enlisted as wedding planner to her best friend Sammy, who's engaged to Amy's ex-boyfriend, Hank. As Amy struggles to balance the demands of Sammy and her editor, she wonders if sparks will fly between her and her former lover. So, you know, standard Hallmark stuff. At the time, Markle opened up to TV Goodness about how refreshing it was to get to play Amy. She told the publication that she had always wanted to do a romantic comedy, and when the script hit her desk, it turned out to be exactly what she was looking for. Markle explained, "...it was light and easy, and it was a departure from Rachel on Suits, who was so refined and polished. Amy Peterson is very opposite and closer to my true personality." The actor even got to wear her own pair of Converse while filming. She told TV Goodness, "...I brought them with me to Vancouver, and I told them I thought it was really, really important as a character choice, and also to preserve my feet that Amy wear these shoes." But for Markle, having comfortable feet was less important than establishing a comfortable relationship between Amy and Sammy. In her TV Goodness interview, she revealed that she was particularly touched by how forgiving the character of Sammy could be. Markle said, "...you see that Amy never wanted to hurt her best friend, but it's complicated when you love someone." In Dater's Handbook, Meghan Markle assumes the role of Cassandra Barber, a businesswoman who struggles with picking the right guy. To aid in her journey toward true love, Cass seeks help from relationship expert Dr. Susie and her latest dating advice book, Dater's Handbook. As she puts the book's suggestions into action, Cass is split between following her own heart and the directions of author Dr. Susie. Just one year after appearing in Dater's Handbook, rumors emerged that Markle was ready to quit acting after finding love with Prince Harry. As it turns out, aside from wrapping up her time on Suits, Cassandra was the star's last role before she quit acting and stepped into royal life. However, now that she and Harry have stepped down as senior royals, only time will tell if Meghan Markle will return to acting — or to Hallmark. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more list videos about the latest hot topics are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.